Hi guys, it's Laura and I'm back with another video. I don't know if you guys have heard how 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 can you hear? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna I have something that I need to tell you guys. I have been living in Saudi Arabia for a bit more than three and a half years and I'm gonna be leaving in less than a month. Yes, I'm leaving forever and no, I can't believe it's happened this fast because if it were for me, I would have stayed here for a couple more years because honestly, I've loved the experience that I've had in this country. But I have to leave, so I decided to do this video which is things that I will and won't miss about Saudi Arabia. Before we get into the video, I would like to ask you to leave down below any video ideas that you would like me to do or any kind of questions and maybe I can do a Q&A soon. So for this video, I made a list on my phone of the things that I will and won't miss, but the things that I will miss are a lot more than the things I won't. Alright, so I'm just gonna go and say them randomly as they come up. I will not miss everything closing for 30 minutes for prayer time 5 times a day. I will miss the multicultural lesson, so all the cultures living together and just having friends from everywhere in the world. Multiculturalism. What? I will miss my school here, all the people that I've met and speaking in English, because even though it was such a huge change for me, I feel like going back to Spanish is gonna be even a little bit weird, because I honestly don't want to forget my English, and I think that just going back to school in Spanish is gonna be a bit of a change. I won't miss the crazy traffic here. I will miss the food variety because I really love all Arab foods and also I won't miss the Saudi culture itself. I won't miss the general chaos in the city and the bit of disorganization in every place because for example the city is being built and it's just so disorganized and just in general when you go some places you can see the disorganization there so I won't miss that. I will miss the prayer call because I honestly think it sounds so beautiful and I'll just miss hearing it five times a day every single day. I will also miss seeing men and their thobes being always so clean and white with no wrinkles. I will not miss the food places closed in Ramadan. I will miss simple places such as Jarir where I can just go and find everything. There aren't the stores like that in Spain. Or Janadria where I can go and just see a bit more about the Saudi culture. I'll really miss that. I will not miss having to wear an abaya everywhere I go because although it has its good things like I can wear pajamas underneath, I still don't like being forced to wear it, so I will not miss that. Especially I won't miss it with the heat. I will miss living in a compound where everything is easy, you have just your friends around, it's so easy to meet them and just you can go to activities and you have a lot of freedom here, so I will miss living in a compound. I will not miss Mutawas telling us to cover our heads. And last, but definitely not least, I will really miss the Saudi reunions with a lot of Saudi coffee and pastries, chocolate and all of that. And just everything that I've gotten from this experience and everything I've learned and all that I've changed because of it. So this is it for today's video, I hope you guys liked it. If you did, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to see more of my videos and bye, see you soon!